Hi, my name is James Fitzpatrick. I'm currently taking my PhD at University College Dublin on the topic of using machine learning to solve electric vehicle reading problems. So, it's coming up to Christmas and the Science of Logistical Division has started planning, as always, to deliver the toys to children of the world. This year is different, however. The head logistical elf has to work with very difficult circumstances. Most of Europe is now in lockdown and Santa, even if he wanted to, can't visit each of the houses individually. Instead, the warehouse in Lapland has to outsource its operations to local delivery services in each town and city in order to complete those deliveries. So, with such a strain on the logistical infrastructure this year, we have an interest, or at least Santa does, in making sure that the whole operation works as smoothly as possible, that the routes of the delivery vehicles are as efficient as possible, and they don't travel further or take more time than is absolutely necessary. Now, usually Santa already has a very difficult optimization problem. He has to visit each home in the world, deliver the presents, and do so before Christmas Day arrives. And he does this by computing the shortest route possible, among all the very many valid routes that he could possibly choose. And in fact, there are so many of those possible routes that he could have chosen, that the number of stars in the universe doesn't even compare to it. That's how difficult this problem is. But luckily, he had tools designed just for this purpose, and those tools are the combination of more than 60 years of research. And it still takes a long time to compute these routes when he does want to do them. But this year, as we said, he's a very different problem and a very difficult problem. He wants to make sure his delivery companies get to toys to each child. And his sled is magic, so he can fly for as far as he wants and for as long as he needs. And it can also fit all the millions of toys that he requires onto a sled. But the delivery trucks can only travel so far and they can only carry so much before they have to go home. And also on top of that, the naughty list is continuously being updated. Worst of all, we have to solve this problem for each town and each city. And we don't have a specialized algorithm to help us, nor do we have the ability to take into account all these new constraints or decades uh, to pour into designing an algorithm to do that. So in the real world, very difficult routing problems are solved every day. Rather than design a perfectly optimized algorithm by hand, what we can do is use historical data, simulations and machine learning to learn a good algorithm instead. We can design a framework for this learning process to handle the new constraints so that we can quickly learn fast new algorithms to solve new classes of problems that we will need to solve very regularly. In particular, what I wish to do is to develop these methods to help us come to terms with the introduction of electric vehicles for logistical networks, to satisfy the new constraints associated with them, to identify optimal routes and maybe near optimal routes, and also to reduce energy emissions. And hopefully this can help us accelerate the phasing out of internal combustion engine vehicles and also the adoption uh, of greener, more sustainable modes of transportation.